How to find a statute using Westlaw Next. Here is the Westlaw Next interface after I've gone through the sign-in screen. I'm interested in finding a statute, so I can go down to the Statutes and Court Rules link and click through. All of the states appear here. Since I know I want to find a Colorado statute, I can click on Colorado. All of the titles in the Colorado Revised Statutes now appear. If I don't know my specific statute number, I can use the large search box at the top of the screen. I can type in keywords to find the statute. Let's say I'm interested in the statute covering first degree murder. I can type in murder first degree and then either hit enter on my keyboard or click the search box. Murder in the first degree, section 18-3-102 is the first result. If I knew my statute citation ahead of time, I could easily just type that into the large search box when I came to the Colorado Statutes and Court Rules page, 18-3-102. Again, murder in the first degree is the first result. I can click through that and view the text of the statute itself. Note that over on the right hand side is a section called Notes of Decisions. There are 745 of them. They're broken down by sp specific topics. Let's say I was interested in amnesia traumatic defenses. I can click through that link and I'm presented with cases that talk about that specific defense. I can click through one of those cases, let's say Watkin versus People, to read the actual decision itself. You can see that this particular case was decided on December 6 of 1965. You receive a short synopsis of the case itself and then the West Head Notes. Each headnote covers a specific legal issue that is covered within the case. After the headnotes, you get to the opinion itself. You can see that this opinion was authored by Justice Day. So that's how you can find a statute using Westlaw Next, either by going directly from the citation or using a keyword search. I hope this has been helpful. Please feel free to contact any research librarian if you have a question.